This mnemonic is about salmonella. This video deals specifically with the salmonella typhi species. There is a salmon fish in the fish bowl, so salmon represents salmonella. The salmon is present inside a glass bowl. The glass bowl represents a capsule. So salmonella typhi has a capsule having VI antigen. Like the salmon fish which can swim and move, salmonella is also motile. As you can see the fish bowl is kept on a black table. The black table represents formation of black colonies on TSI medium and the black color of the colonies is due to the production of H2S gas. So salmonella produces hydrogen sulfide gas in the TSI medium or the triple sugar iron medium. You can see a lemonade on the table and since lemon is acidic, it tells us that salmonella is acid labile, hence it is easily destroyed by the gastric acids in the stomach. Therefore, there is a need of a high dose of salmonella to produce infection. You can see a boy is watching the fish which represents that salmonella typhi is transmitted only in humans, unlike the non-typhoidal salmonella which is transmitted in the poultry. The thermometer represents that salmonella typhi causes enteric fever or typhoidal fever. The red spots on the boy's shirt represents rose spots seen in enteric fever. Diarrhea is seen in typhoid fever which is specifically called pea soup diarrhea. The boy has been served a green soup which represents pea soup diarrhea seen as a complication in enteric fever. Live attenuated vaccines are available for typhoid which is represented by this injection. Salmonella typhi grows abundantly in the gallbladder. The gallbladder has been represented by the green bucket and inside it the foam represents bile which acts as a good culture medium for it. The bucket is there probably to clean the mess may be created by a cat. So you can see fish bones lying on the ground. You can see some blood with the fish bones. It represents that salmonella is associated with osteomyelitis in sickle cell anemia. Lastly, we come to the treatment which is done with fluoroquinolones, which is represented by flowers beside the fish. Besides all this, you must remember the steps involved in lab diagnosis of enteric fever caused by salmonella typhi. For this, remember the mnemonic BASU, which stands for blood culture, which comes positive in the first week, then agglutination test, which is the vital test, which comes positive in the second week, then comes stool culture which comes positive in the third week and then urine culture which comes positive in the fourth week. That's it. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, do check out the other videos of the Bacteriology Mnemonic series and do not forget to subscribe.